As Brad just mentioned, significant ice could be accumulating for parts of the Carolinas. That's going to make driving very dangerous. Crews already out preparing the roads to make them safe if you do have to drive tomorrow. But there are some things that you can do tonight to prepare as well. Meteorologist Chris Mulcahy has some last minute tips to get you prepared. Accumulating ice has been a major story to our west, but now it's the Carolinas turn where these roads and these sidewalks could be an icy mess come Thursday morning. Here's what you need to know to prepare. First, you should have plenty of gas. If you're out this evening, gas up the car. But just because you have the gas doesn't mean you should be driving tomorrow morning. Also, those tires should be full. Every 10 degrees we drop, we lose 1 to 2 PSI in your tires, and the lower tire pressure means less control on the road. Make sure your phone is charged or you have a backup charger because a lot of us could lose power and you always want to keep a line of communication just in case of emergency. Also, a first aid kit and an emergency supply kit should be at the ready for all Mother Nature's tricks. And know where a flashlight is. One quick tip. Make sure that your freezer and refrigerator are on their coldest settings. You want to be as cold as possible in here in case the power goes out, but only open it if you absolutely have to. Check your carbon monoxide detectors. Make sure the backup batteries are good to go, and you should do the same for your smoke detectors. So again, don't drive if you don't have to, and watch for any low-hanging branches as the ice will be accumulating Thursday morning. Wishing you all stay safe. I'm meteorologist Chris Mulcahy with WCNC Charlotte.